Hey, what's going on Beach Bums? I'm going to do a room tour here for you at room 3239. So this is an interior room over here. So it's the, right uh, by the atrium bar area and stuff. So it's kind of nice and convenient. So here we go. Um, it's a nice king bed. So last time I was on here on October 2nd, I had a, excuse me, one a upper lower room. That's what I booked, but they moved me to this room, which is nice. Um, I guess it would be considered an upgrade. Um, so at no cost, which was really nice. So you got the two uh, nightstands here, and of course the king bed in the middle. Got your nice little luggage mat, case, uh, luggage mat. But uh, in case you want to see this, how much space you have in these nightstands, so you got that one there that you could put stuff in. Got another one over here. So I'm rolling solo on this cruise, so all this space to myself, but if you were uh, coming with a significant other, uh, you'd have to share all that. But then you got the TV over here, little area, I ordered some water as you can see there. So you've got the uh, shelving, the little fridge. Now, and one thing I want to point out, as you can see, there's uh, vents here now, and I don't know if that's on just the newer ships and uh, Here's the refrigerator, refrigerator, so you can see um, the size of that. You can hold. I'll, I'll put some waters and stuff in there and show you. So I might add on to this as um, maybe after I unpack and as I put stuff, so you guys can kind of see what uh, what all there is and how it, you know everything kind of lays out. So you got your little pool towels, pool beach towels, a little vanity area, your plugs. So you got your two USB over here. And two uh, regular ports, your phone, and your safe with a bunch of shelving and uh, drawers. And over here on this side, you've got the uh, where you can hang your clothing. So you got your excuse me, your hangers, and uh, got my backpack down there. I'm gonna bring in my luggage here in a little bit, but want to keep them out for right now, just so. There's the door with all your standard emergency instruction notices and notice information. Let's go to the bathroom here. Again, just your standard bathroom, um, shampoo and shower gel, no conditioner. So those of you that need conditioner, uh, there's the shower head in case you're curious about that. If you want to hang clothing, I got the, uh, the little thing here to, to do that. All of your towels and uh, so all this area, like I said, I'm, when I unpack, I'll probably just do a little like add-on or addendum to this video so you can kind of see how much um, stuff you can hold. Trash can and stuff down here, some extra supplies. So, um, yeah, that is this room. Oh, there's uh, how they, you control the air in these rooms. It's right now it's all the way down at the bottom. All right, guys, like I said, I will, uh, when I put my waters in there and that kind of thing, I'll just add on. If there's certain things I find out or want to add to it, like I said, I will, uh, when I put this video together and editing, uh, I'll, I'll pop on anything additional. So thank you for watching. I really appreciate it. If you like what you're um, hearing here and are connected and are, or if you're not subscribed, definitely consider subscribing to this channel. I'm The Beach Life. My name is Hani. And uh, I'll have other videos from the Carnival Panorama. Uh, I have some from my October 2nd cruise already on here. I'll be adding more to that. And then this cruise here, it's October 30th, 2021. Thanks, guys. Thank you for watching. Hello everyone, welcome to this room tour of interior cabin 3239 on the Carnival Panorama. This is October 30th, 2021. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and come on in. Just a couple things I wanna point out. The doors are magnetic, but uh, in order for things to stay on, I had to use uh, little adhesive strips, the ones that you can take off uh, fairly easily without causing any damage. Also, one other thing I want to point out is um, I had a spare card they had given me before. You could pretty much put anything in there, business card or uh, anything that you might have. But to uh, that, so you can keep the light on, so you don't have to keep your regular card in there. And walking in here, um, I've unpacked. So um, this is a king size bed here with the two different nightstands uh, on either side. I'm going solo on this cruise, so it'll just be me. Um, my wife was not able to make it, but so um, we have a TV here, uh, some shelving, those type of things. Uh, there, 
and uh, just wanted to show you here in the refrigerator, refrigerator excuse me, the um, I've got 12 bottles of water in there, so you can just kind of get a general idea. Uh, one nice thing is that there is a vent in these. I know in some of the older ships, apparently there wasn't vents, um, so people would have to like <laughs> put little clips here or things like that to allow it. But now you don't have to worry about that because it's already properly vented. So just one other thing you, I wanted to point out: you've got this uh, area here. You can see all my electronic equipment and things like that in there. Again, I, I have unpacked so you can kind of have a general idea of how much clothing. I had to ask for three more hangers because I brought a lot of shirts this time. Because when I was here on October 2nd, I didn't um, I didn't bring enough shirts. So um, I got my shoes down here. Just got belts and miscellaneous stuff here. Some hats and some costumes. This is Halloween week. Wait. Sweat shorts, um, regular shorts, and things like that. So just a general um, idea of what we have for storage. Uh, shoes, I think I mentioned that, down there. And uh, yeah, there's not really much to it. It's, uh, it's a, you know, it's good for one person, maybe even two, you know, comfortably, obviously. But other than that, uh, thanks for watching. Much appreciated. We'll talk to you all later.